hello everyone how have you been welcome again to my youtube channel if you are new here you are welcome my name is damiola etola i'm a medical doctor and i feel about faith medicine and lifestyle in today's video i'll be talking about vagina hygiene and i'll be sharing with you how i got the idea for this video all right so um a few months ago i was um invited to a group where i spoke to um a number of women about vagina hygiene and at the end of our discussion um some people asked me some questions that i, I just couldn't believe my ears all right and this is actually not made up it's the truth so some people were asking that is it okay to wash your vagina with salt someone told them that they can um steam their vagina with um scent leave that's a thing and even in the hospital i've met women which with um vagina infection I was asking me like, is it okay to use um bitter leaf to wash your vagina because that's what they've been doing or is it okay to wash with salt and i'm like hold on don't do that just stop if you've been doing it because it's a bad habit and whoever told you that the person is not well informed and the fact that something has become a trend does not mean it's the right thing to do like you need to make your research ask questions is this good for me is this going to hurt me don't say oh because vagina steamy with yoni pearls or um bitter leaf or whatnot is trending now so you should jump on it no that's not why it's actually a foolish thing to do all right so before i um proceed with this video please don't forget to watch this video to the end subscribe to my channel if you are yet to and like this video share with your friends and family and i would like to see your comments or questions in the comment section all right so um the first Thing is what is the vagina so the vagina is an elastic muscular canal that connects your uterus to the outside world it's as simple as that your vagina connects your uterus to the outside world so the next thing will be what are the functions of the vagina number one it serves as a conduit for menstrual flow number two the vagina receives the penis during sexual intercourse and then the third thing is that the vagina serves as a birth canal during delivery all right so the next thing would be um a vaginal discharge normal or abnormal the truth is vaginal discharge could be both normal and abnormal this depends on the consistency the color and the odor of the discharge all right so normal vaginal discharge happens every day so live with it it happens every day and the discharge could range from um clear to yellow in color and from thick to slippery in consistency depending on your menstrual cycle and this varies um, with regards to your hormonal fluctuations all right so when this um, becomes foul smelling purulent discharge with yellowish green odor smelling like fish or thick whitish discharge vaginal itching burning ulcers sores around um your private parts then that means that something is wrong and you should take those things as your cue to visit your health care provider i know a lot of women are embarrassed you are shy you are ashamed you don't want to talk to your doctor about your vaginal health but please don't stay at home don't hesitate don't resort to using about concussions or using sores and what not go to the hospital to receive proper treatment um for whatever is wrong with you all right so um the fourth thing would be should you be washing your vagina hell no like capital no you're not supposed to wash your vagina your vagina is a magic organ that has superpowers in the sense that it can cleanse itself it's not like your skin that you have to wash every day with soap and your sponge or your teeth that you have to brush maybe twice a day with your toothbrush and your toothpaste no your vagina cleanses itself by itself yes you heard that right so your vagina is lined with numerous LD bacteria that help to um keep away the bad guys and also your vagina is super acidic and this acidic environment helps to keep away harmful bacteria so like they're like your military personnel that help to fight the terrorists away um, from your environment you understand that all right so this is why sometimes when you look at your underwear it looks as if it is bleached like you put jig on it and that's because of the acidic nature of your vagina so what you should be washing is your vulva so and you wash with warm water not um washing with soap or washing with scented wipes or whatever you wash your vulva with warm water and that's going to be enough all right so this takes us to the last part of this discussion and that's 
vagina hygiene how should you care for your vagina number one don't wear wet underwear don't even wear damp underwear make sure that your underwear is very dry the second thing is that don't wash from the back to the front this is because when you wash from the back to the front you are going to introduce harmful bacteria in your anus and bring them to your vagina and this is going to predispose you to infection all right the third thing is that don't use all these yoni pearls feminine hygiene products that promises to cleanse your vagina it's a lie it's going to distort the ph of your vagina and introduce you to harmful infections okay fourth thing is that you should change your sanitary pads and your tampons um regularly at least six hours if you forget your tampon then you're introducing yourself to um staphylococcus um, toxic shock syndrome and the next thing is that you should wear undergarments that are made of cotton because it is breathable and then the last thing is that don't sleep with your underwear allow your vagina to breathe allow fresh air to enter all right so this brings us to the end of this video i hope that you learned a thing or two Please don't forget to share this video with your friends and family. If you watch to the end, I'm really thankful. Um, I'm really grateful. Thank you. Please don't forget to share with your friends and family. I would like to see your comments in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, until next time, stay safe and remain blessed. Thank you. Bye-bye.